This is Thuja plicata, the western red cedar. And as you can see, there's some nice big cedars here. Uh, this is an area that burned several years ago. And uh, there's quite a lot of young cedars. When you're gathering the, the branches for uh, essential oil, what you want is actually these very tip top branches here where the leaves are just brand new and it's extremely resinous. These very tip top uh, branches you can see they're very moist they're very green it's been raining a lot lately here what you want to make sure is it has that good strong cedar smell which they do and uh, you just need a little bit and both the, the bark and these tender leaves have the most active uh, essential oils that, that are um, will be I'll be distilling so you want to gather these very tender red cedar tips from these small young cedar trees and you don't need a lot that will make quite a bit of oil right there here we have these the still the uh, steam dil distillation system so what we have here is a collector right here and that's for the hydrosol which will come off as it starts to boil and it's just starting to heat up now it's got an electric hot plate you have the bottom part there where the water sits we use um, unchlorinated well water that we have here at the uh, homestead so there you can see the water is boiling the uh, the steam is rising up into the material. One thing that I didn't mention with the red cedar and most uh, most of the herbal products, what I did is I dried it a little bit and then I just uh, lightly put maybe an ounce of organic uh, 190 proof alcohol in there and let that uh, drain off. And that will also evaporate whatever's remaining. And that helps to release some of the essential oil and also to uh, break down some of the plant material so that the water can get in there and the steam and enable it to process the essential oil. Here you can see on some of the lab equipment here, we have a couple clamps here that come from the back of the uh, heater and it attaches there one clamp attaches right here to hold it at the base then the second clamp goes to the uh, the double walled condenser and then in addition we have these uh, red plastic uh, lab clamps that also help to uh, hold everything together so here we see this is only after about uh, 15 or 20 minutes that top layer is the essential oil. Uh, hydrosol is dripping down and the oil, because it's lighter than the water, will come to the top. You can see it's very, very oily, uh, very resinous, and that's separating off really well right now. Getting a lot of oil out of here. Uh, this is again the uh, steam distillation for Western Red Cedar.